All smiles and lots of dancing Wednesday afternoon. PIX11 News visited and joined the celebration of a center finally reopened, and it feels great. These Bronx seniors are so happy to have lunch in their lunchroom and activities again inside their beloved senior center, the heart of their community. It's been seven long months of repairs, and their hearts were broken when it was closed. Here we have a leak from above. Classes have been held outside since last August and lunches to go. Inside, ceilings look like this. We are very angry. The director here at the Melrose Mont Haven Senior Center, Alicia Gomez, asked PIX11 News for some help. She showed us problems in the lobby, the center's cafeteria kitchen, the lunchroom. We could see water dripping from the ceiling. There were rusted pipes in the ceilings just above a place seniors played bingo. The feeling that I get out of this is that NYCHA just does not care. NYCHA promised to do the work. We always go back. We're so happy, just so super happy. Wait until you see what we've done inside. Take a look at the lunchroom now. The hallways, kitchen, and rec rooms are all fixed with new floors and new ceilings. No one is happier than the seniors who call this place a home away from home. It looks like a brand new location, actually. Wait until you see the floors, the ceilings, um, the dining room. We have lovely colors. Um, it's just the energy. We're happy to be back home. How do the seniors feel? I mean, that's the most important part. How are the seniors loving it? Well, since they walked in, they've been dancing. A special thanks to Council Member Rafael Salamanca and Congressman Richie Torres for fighting for repairs for these seniors. And a special thanks to NYCHA for making it happen. And if you have a story, you know what to do. Just reach out to us at Monica Morales TV on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. We're making it happen in the Bronx. Monica Morales, PIX11 News.